guys, this is Fiendbrain91, and I'm talking about the Nintendo Switch and cloud gaming. Now, for those of you who didn't watch the Nintendo Direct, well, maybe go watch it and come back, but Dying Light 2 should be coming to the Switch, but through the cloud. Now, I do remember that, like, a few games, I believe, came to the Switch via the cloud. I think Resident Evil 7 was one of the first games, if not the first, to come to the Switch via the cloud, right? But... It wasn't a thing that was actually happening too often as far as I remember, but now it seems like it's happening more often than I like because apparently the HD remasters of Kingdom Hearts 3, Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5, 2.5 Remix, and Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue. Now, this is all cool. It's good that these games are coming to the Switch, right? But the fact that they're coming in cloud is what concerns me. Now, let me just say this. I actually would prefer they come in cloud version than not come at all. Like if a developer, if a developer can't scale the game game down to a level where they're still comfortable releasing it on the Switch, then fine. Release it via the cloud. But the problem with the cloud gaming is it takes away a big aspect of the Switch, and that is being able to play on the go without an internet connection. Because apparently this is according to N Americas dash support.nintendo.com the cloud version requires a stable connection to high speed internet to play so it doesn't only require internet it requires high speed internet according to support.nintendo.com so what i'm trying to say is that i like these, that these games coming to switch but the cloud because if i'm if i want to play especially since the games i just mentioned di yes dying light you can play co-op but you can play these games as single player and with the Switch, I'm pretty sure a good amount of people like to go wherever they're, you know, maybe they're on the subway, on the bus, or whatever, and they like to play their single-player games while in transit and stuff like that, but you won't most likely be able to do that with these games since they're on the cloud. See, if it was the Xbox or PlayStation 4, I don't think it'd be that big of a deal, because most of the time I think people play them when they're around an internet connection, since I think most of the time people play them at home. But I really think the Nintendo Switch its ability to take on the go and play like single player games especially because if you're playing multiplayer games for the most part you're gonna need an internet connection anyway so especially when it comes to single player or like single player focused or a game that has a good single player mode I really think the developers need to try hard to get these games even if you have to downscale them a bit onto the switch proper now let me just emphasize if they can't do that yes then bring it to the Switch on the cloud because it's better for it to be on the Switch than not be on Switch at all, I believe, for most cases. But I just hope that some developers aren't taking the easy way out here. Like, I hope they at least try first to see if they can downscale the game prop enough to where they're still comfortable releasing it on the Switch before they turn to bringing it on the Switch via the cloud. But what do you guys think about the amount of cloud games that seemingly are coming to the Switch. Do you wish they could have been brought to the Nintendo Switch in a more proper way? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. May God bless you all.